Hello, I'm here today to do a video review on the Happy Camper two-person tent. We bought ours on Amazon. You can also get it at Target, Walmart. Ours was $17.99, so it's not a huge investment, but it is money. And I was not able to find a video or photos anywhere reviewing this tent. So I figured for people looking to buy it, that way they kind of knew what they were getting. So here's all the way around it. It's not very big. The colors are really nice, um, blue and yellow. This is what it comes with. So over here we have the bag, the tiny little rainfly, which isn't going to do much, and then the bag that the posts and the stakes came in. So. It has um, two poles that you connect, standard, just like with any other tent. And then you run it from this side to down there. And then this one from that side to the other side. And they connect down here in this first hole. And then here is the stake to hold the tent down. So there's four of them. It is supposed to be a two-person tent. Um, I wouldn't recommend it unless you are two very, very small people. It is not very big at all. I'll step back so you can kind of get a better idea of it. However, from I would recommend it for kids, probably to the age two kids could probably fit in here. Till about the age of 12, maybe 14 if they're smaller kids, or two adults if they don't mind being super packed. You're not going to have room for bags or anything inside the tent with two people. For one person, I wouldn't recommend it for serious camping because the written reviews on Amazon were that... If it rains, the water's just gonna soak right through, and I believe it. The material, while it's nice, it's not very thick, and I, I don't think it's very water resistant. The bottom does come up, as you can see, about three to four inches. Um, whether or not that really is gonna keep rain out from the bottom, I don't know without a tarp under it. So it zips up all the way down and then you can open it and tie it back over here. The other side is knotted, the kids, kids got it knotted, but um, so right here you can tie, tie the little doors back and then it unzips again here and then at the bottom. So the only part that completely zips up is the screen part and then this outside part, the bottom, it's not sealed. It's only sealed right here. It's perfect for play, perfect for kids. Like I said, it's been very windy here and it's, it's stayed up really well. Um, the stakes, I mean, it's, it holds. You can, you can really shake it and it's it's not going anywhere the material is nice it's not very thick so I honestly I really wouldn't recommend this for big camping or if the weather's nasty outside I I don't think this itty bitty little rain fly is gonna hold the rain out um, and the material here on the side it's it's very it's not very thin, but it is. So here's with the rain fly on. This did not come with any instructions whatsoever. So I'm guessing from putting tents together previously that this is where it's supposed to connect. It, there's nowhere else for it to connect. 
Um, it's not going to stretch to down here. You could probably buy a different rainfly. So each side, that's where I connected it. So it's not very big. It does cover up the screened area a little bit. It does cover it up, but you know, as you can imagine, rain is going to drip off of here, bam, right onto the tent. And you're going to wake up probably pretty wet. So I would not recommend this for, for the serious camper, only dry conditions, maybe a couple nights. Backyard, backyard camping for the kids is perfect. Um, backpacking, it's very light. It's uh, 2.5 pounds altogether. Once it's in its bag right there, it, it does, it rolls up very nicely. It's perfect. Um, it's perfect for kids and for like one adult, but no, like I said, no serious camping. I imagine if you threw a tarp over it, but so the inside, let's... so here's the inside of the tent. Pretty small. There's two screens up top. Without the rain fly on, you could look up at the stars. Um, a couple of the written reviews on Amazon were that the screen, the holes in it, um, aren't, aren't small enough and that bugs were just getting in. I haven't, haven't experienced that yet, but here's, you know, a look at what the screen is like same thing that's up there if you're backpacking overnight one night and you just have you know backpack and nothing else that would probably work out fine so completely open the colors are really nice it is sturdy as far as wind goes um, so overall it's a good tent, and I hope this review helps you, you know, in your purchasing or, you know, looking around. Or if you bought it, you kind of can see what it looks like put, it to, you know, put together. So thank you for watching.